morning, y'all. I have um, been so busy the last week and few days um, that I didn't get a video out on Friday like I would like to. So maybe I'll go back to the little short clips because I can do them faster. And FYI, I am working inside. I have a borrowed ladder. Um, and the, the trim that we chose to use in here is not normal trim because I couldn't afford it. So being on a low income, one of the things that happens is if you um, choose to do something less expensive, it's often time consuming. And obviously I have more time than I have money right now. Uh, well, most of the time. So what we did was I had leftover beadboard paneling. I had like, I think I had two sheets and we flipped it over on the back. It's smooth, but it's like masonite and we cut strips and that's what you're seeing as the brown stuff. It's not going to stay brown. And I have one of these little, um, probably from a dollar store of some kind, cheap sand and sponge things um, because they're expensive if you buy them in a regular, like big box hardware store or something. I'm sanding the edges because my little trim saw that I have, I have a Black & Decker Matrix set that has a trim saw on it. It cuts well, but it's not a fine cut. So everything's fuzzy. So um, Tim and Danny were here early this week and um, they have something to do next week and they graciously let me borrow their ladder. So my job is to tape off the things that don't want to be painted and to sand and then to paint um, because I might not see Tim and Danny for, um, it's possible it will be a couple of weeks. I'm not 100% sure. And so, um, so I thought since I can put the tablet on its stand, I apologize uh, for the people who don't like the way I dress or my clothes or whatever. But these are my work clothes today. And you just, you know, please get over it. And please don't give me a hard time. I wish I looked better. Yes. I wish I had nicer clothes. Absolutely. But my priority right now is not my clothes and my looks. My priority right now is staying healthy and getting this studio in some kind of shape so that I have my choices back. And um, we're about two weeks from using, can you see that stuff in the corner? Using all these boxes. All these boxes are my stovepipe and the adapters and, uh, uh, yeah, and the adapters and things to put my wood stove right here. And uh, my wood stove's in the other corner right now, just sitting waiting. But uh, the, for those of you who are new to my channel or whatever, some of you know that I'm allergic to propane, and so I don't use wood to supplement my heat. And in the vein of keeping things simple, I use wood for my heat and my cooking. So I have some gunk on the door. I'm going to try to, even though it'll get painted white, it would be nice if it's smoothish. Um, I'll do, you know, some of these projects I'll do my best and hopefully I won't have to come back too many times. I'm not planning on painting the doors right now. Uh, it's more important that I get first the corner where the wood stove's going painted and then other things. Let's see. I want to, I'm going to put uh, in the comments below some little list of some of the other people, my daily mantra note. Um, uh, I'm going to put a list of some of the other people who have YouTube channels that live in my general community. Um, that being said, what I mean by that is that live in my county and have YouTube channels. Um, that way anybody who's just, you know, looking to see, am I the only one that's having this problem? Or, you don't believe me or I don't know what. <laughs> I just thought it might be interesting and it may help 
some of those other channels out a little bit. Um, there's no reason not to help other people out. Um, I'm still at this point in time not making any money, but I'm uh, off of the channel. But uh, I am doing my best to provide you guys something. Let's see. Um, I got two big surprises this week. Um, it does, if you guys do choose to look at my Amazon wish list and you choose to send me something, um, I'm taking some cues from one of my neighbors who also does a YouTube channel. And I'm going to even put out some things like grocery items that I would have to buy. Um, I wasn't going to do that because I thought that was a little weird. But they get help so much. <laughs> and I can use, just FYI, I can use my EBT, which is food stamps. I can use that on Amazon. And I do. And like this month, as one of my extra EBTs, I bought Bob's Red Mill Millet um, to store so that I have extra, so there's food here that I can eat that I'm not allergic to. Um, but if anybody chooses to buy something off of my wish list, I'm gonna, I'm gonna turn you, if I can do this. There we go, I'm gonna turn you over here a little bit. I have a basket on the floor. I'm gonna go over to this corner. And um, for right now, thrift store baskets are like real cheap in my particular area. I think I paid 50 cents maybe for this basket. But it has all my journals and stuff in it. And Lovely lady online, shoot, I forgot her name, um, but she got on the wish list and she bought me this um, RV vent cap for me to use for venting my bathroom smells out of the uh, off-grid outdoor bathroom. Um, and so thank you so much. I have to go look up her, her um, name again. Anyway, um, and then Danny, my, my good friend Danny bought me two solar lights. This one I have chosen is going to be mounted in the, in the ceiling inside. The other one, I have to move something because I was working and now I'm filming, right? Nothing like... Uh, and, and this is the second one he got me. And so I'm going to put the prettier one inside. And this one is probably going to go in my outdoor kitchen space which I'm revising right now. And uh, thank you so, so much, Danny. What a blessing that is. And I already charged the, the one in the green box. I charged it for two days outside, like it said, and I put it back in the box so nothing will happen to it while I'm painting. What else do I want to tell you? I, I would love to walk you around outside and show you some other stuff, but I'm really pushing myself to do this stuff. I'm tired and my back sore. I've been digging a lot of dirt. <coughs> Pardon me. So, uh, that's what I'm working on today. Um, and again, I could try to show you this. Again, I have had to move everything inside. Okay. I am going to lift this stand off the wall, okay, and try not to make you dizzy, all right? But I have to move everything inside. I have to fold my bed up to make enough room to work. So I have this pile. That's everything I own. It's such a mess. Well, I guess I shouldn't say everything I own. Close to everything I own. You know, there's a few things outdoors, but dang, it's a mess. And then... You know, I can't wait to be finished enough with this so I don't have to keep moving things how many times a day. So um, I hope you all have a great day. The weather's good today. It's been hot for a couple of days. Um, but uh, I'm working on getting this stuff together. So um, I'm going to go back to work. And I don't think you guys really want to watch me sand all this stuff and put painter's tape up. So I will talk to you all later. You have a wonderful day. Keep it simple. Use what you already have and travel light and often.